What's going on, everyone? Welcome to Trading Crypto. Today we're over Rari Governance or RGT up 82.8% at $8.60. Max supplies only 12 million. Circulating supplies 11 million. I like that because the circulating supply is almost to the max supply, which means they can't unload a lot more coins on you guys. Market caps only 106 million. All time high in this coin was $64. Seven months ago, all time low was a year ago at 21 cents. You can see we absolutely took off. Just by looking at the 24 hour, this coin is currently available on these exchanges. So with that, let's get into the price prediction and technical analysis on Rari. <laughs> G. If you find this content useful and you'd like to support the channel, head over to the Trading Crypto homepage where you can become a member. Click on the Join tab. It is $4.99 for a month. You get membership shoutouts, membership online chats, and priority replies and comments along with loyalty badges. With that okay, let's get into Rari. So Rari absolutely took off. The RSI just broke above 32. You have all this room to possibly run on the RSI until you're actually overbought. That is massive. Um, don't consider that as a great buying opportunity like you guys are going to go out there because if you look in the past you haven't been that high since april of 2022 can you get back out there yes but when you have a huge moonshot like this you have retracements people start taking profit from when they bought him back here so just keep that in mind macd is just straight off the charts right now that's nuts we're gonna draw a film on this It'll be a little bit different because you guys broke market structure so we're gonna draw a fit from here to the past right up here and let's try to dissect this a little bit further we'll go right here so as you can see right now you guys are getting stopped at the 382 you guys hard candled right to the 382 wicked well above it rsi definitely has room to run macd isn't close to crossing over yet so there's two different scenarios that we could be going by here first is this 382 is nothing you guys are to blast right through it so we're to talk about the bullish scenario first for rsi as of right now the rs uh, not RSI and RGT. As of right now, the RSI is absolutely low for a moonshot like this. You guys just broke above 30 and you guys are taking off. There's so much room to go on the RSI before you're overbought. So could you go up higher? Most definitely you can. But in the market that we're in right now with all the volatility, people are going to start taking profits. People who bought in back here are going to start taking profits. And you could see a dip. But I'm just giving you guys the data right now, which is initiating you guys have a lot more room you could possibly be taking off. The only thing that concerns me is the MACD. Look at that candle compared to all the rest of the MACD. You guys have not been this high. Uh, so with that and the RSI, I'd be very cautious on buying right now. So we're at the 382 at $8.74. I personally think we can work our way back up to $9.47. I think we'll have a very difficult time getting over that. We need to cool down on the MACD before we can add higher. So I could be seeing something like this and a continuation of higher on rgt personally i probably wouldn't be buying in right now because when you buy into these runs like this you're buying into the gas and people that bought in down here to start taking profits and people who start buying in at the top when they start seeing the price fall could sell and it could be a cascading effect so just be very cautious and buying in right now especially when something's up almost 100 percent so for the short term as you can see this is the four hour and there's a lot of volatility this Candle continues to decrease and increase as we're charting this video. And this is the four hour. Imagine if we were on the one hour right now, it would just be flying. So just to break it down for you guys, I personally think what we need to keep an eye on is the 382 right here at 881. That's our price we need to beat to continue higher. If we beat that, our next stop is 947. If we do close below the support, which it does close in one hour, we'd have to assess the situation at that time because then you'd have to get back over all this. If we do close below the su support at $8, I do think we might have some sort of retracement for a continuation higher, which actually wouldn't be bad. Uh, I know the RSI is super low right now, but when you have a run up like this, a cool down period is actually healthy. It lets people who bought in at the top get out at a reasonable price and the people at the bottom are still holding on. And then you can go once all that is settled. So for the short term, for RGT, I would be keeping an eye on the 618. Look, this is crazy how this candle is going on the four hour right now. I've never seen anything like that before. So it's very volatile, very risky to get in right now. And the only thing that I'm very attracted by is the low market cap and the RSI is extremely low. So short term, 
we need to keep an eye on eight dollars and 78 cents if we do close below this resistance i do think we're heading down i'd be more on the cautious size side and say hey we're heading down the way that the market is right now things don't look that great so i would be banking on a retracement nonetheless it's always better to be cautious than overzealous so if i wanted to get into this coin and if it does have more room to run, which it does do, I would probably put a buy in order at $6.37. That's not financial advice. That's just what I would do if I wanted to try to ride this run on this coin. I do think we might see a retrace back there. A pullback would be healthy, especially after a giant run up like this. So as volatile as it is right now, I'm going to be bearish on it and say, hey, we're heading down to $2.42. If I'm wrong, the next stop would be the 382 at 881. So the price to be right now is to maintain over this $8 range and keep an eye on the retracement. I do think we do retrace. I just said a bunch of stuff right there, so let me break it down for you. There's two different scenarios. If you're bullish on this, which you could be because of the RSI, we could be heading to the moon <laughs> technically, but I very doubt it with the situation that we're in let's just keep an eye on the 618 618 would tell a story we have an hour for this candle to close if the candle closes above the 618 we'll continue higher if we close below this resistance right here resistance support we're heading down to 637 so this is going to be your storyteller right here is the eight dollar range keep an eye on eight dollars that is going to be the storyteller of rgt congrats on whoever bought him back here that's crazy profit especially with the way the markets are going right now so with that none of this is financial advice and if there's any coins you'd like me to chart or if you just like the chat please join my discord channel you'll find the link below in the description if you like what i do and you want to support the channel make sure you check out my open c account you'll find the link below in the description i have nft starting at five dollars all the way up to charting crypto og coins with